Niger has been Ghana's primary source of onions, supplying a significant portion of the market for many years. However, the coup in Niger and the subsequent closure of borders, coupled with terrorism activities in the area, has disrupted the supply chain heavily, affecting consumers locally. You know, onions is a perishable goose. So at least if you load it, if you keep long inside the car, seven days, if it's more than 10 days, the onions will spoil. So you can imagine a car load onions to stand at the border for weeks. The difficulty with cutting the commodity has resulted in heavy losses for these importers, as many have lost their capital and livelihood. The cars who, who, who blocked there is about 70 plus cars. But the cars who came to Accra here are 15 cars that came here and we couldn't even offload even one single bike to sell. If I tell you the total, the quantum money that we used to buy the onions per single car, is safer. Before you buy a full load, you have to uh, hold 17 million safer. 17 million safer times 18 CD. It will give you a total number of 306,000 Ghana CD. The situation is even more grievous for some of these importers as they raise their capitals through loans. Some of our members have been hospitalized. We've lost all our capital. I used to be an importer, but I lost everything. I carry onions now to survive. They warn that if nothing is done about the situation, prices of onions on the market may increase astronomically. So it's something like uh, 100 million that we spend to come to Accra here. Now that because we are following through that long journey, we are spending about 36,000 Ghana CD. Last year, the, 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 the last price we sold onions in Accra here was 900. But this year, I can tell you that some sell 1,600, some sell 1,500. But the same, uh, if, if they did, did not open the border, I'm sure it will hit 2,000 plus. For the Peasant Farmers Association, now is the time for Ghana to take charge of its onion production to ensure food security. About 90% of the onions that were brought in cannot be used. They all rotten. So for us in Peasant Farmers, we think this is great opportunity for the farmers and other investors who want to go into agriculture to invest in onions production. Shadrach Esrivi, 3Business, Accra.